just lean it on me. You good? Got it. Hey guys, it's John Culinary, and we are at my home in New Jersey and we're giving my living room space a makeover. I wanna have that double duty space where it's cozy for us on those family movie nights, but also really have that elevated design. So when family and friends come over, it's a cool space to hang out. So what you wanna do first is measure out the entire room. Get your pad and pencil, put everything down on a piece of paper so you can always go back and check those measurements. Once you have all of your final measurements, look at what furniture you're gonna be putting inside the space and mark it out with painter's tape. It allows you to really visualize what's gonna go inside your space and if it's gonna fit. So you wanna pick your rug style for function and design. Yeah! Looks look great. That. Nice. I have two small children, a dog and a cat. So we went with a Moroccan rug. It's got a neutral palette, some of those darks and those light grays inside of it, but it's got a pattern. So any of those stains from the kids or the dogs, they're not gonna show up and it's easy to clean. So typical rugs for your living room space are either eight by 10 or nine by 12. We're using a nine by 12 inside of my space and you wanna make sure that you have somewhere between six to eight inches on either side of the sofa. Nice. I think the girls are gonna love this. I like the arms. When selecting your main sofa or chairs, these main pieces are usually the most expensive items inside of the room. Pick neutral pieces in durable fabrics that will really be timeless and you can use it for years. Everything in here is from homedepot.com. Their online store has all you need to create a functional space for living and entertaining. How does that look? Looks like it's made for me. This TV stand also has cabinet space, so it's a great area to store all the kids' books, toys, and blankets. Utilize double duty decor. This two-piece coffee table can easily have a second table stored for when you wanna make more space, but can also be easily brought out that way you have more surface area for drinks when entertaining larger parties. Every seat needs a surface. When designing your space, the goal is to have every seat with easy access to a table. If space is tight, opt for tables that take up less visual real estate, like the ones we're using with an open frame or minimalist shapes and narrow legs. When trying to figure out what type of lighting to put inside your space, you really want something that's gonna set the mood. A floor lamp is gonna give you that visual interest, but on top of it, give you the light that you'll need inside the space. Think outside the box when it comes to art. Paintings and prints are always a good idea, but they aren't your only option. Wall decor like tapestries, sculptural objects, or greenery all work really well as art both on the walls and on tables and bookshelves. Plus, they're perfect for a space that needs a big design impact, but are budget friendly and kid friendly. When accessorizing the room, you wanna make sure that you're finding something that's bold and gonna make a statement. We have our anchor piece of the sofa that is a neutral color, then we have our throw pillows that have bright, bold colors. This is gonna stand out when you're entertaining and having friends over, but on top of it, it's nice and cozy for the kids. The Home Depot has everything from furniture to lighting to finishing touches at really affordable prices. Plus, they have free and flexible delivery so you can easily return things to the store or online. The culinary living room is now complete. The decor looks amazing. I cannot wait to enjoy this and hang out in space.